Some hunters carry lots of colored filters because different colored lights catch different animals' eyes. With Alpha, you can easily scan for foxes, coyotes, coons, and other predators' eyes silently with the red light mode, or you can catch hogs with the green mode. And Alpha even helps you aim for fish when you're bow fishing. After a long night of hunting, it will still be just as bright as when you started. Alpha, the perfect headlamp for every hunter. Now the torch itself is pretty well made actually, you've got a convincing decent button on, on the back here, the hand strap you can actually take off personally, I prefer to do this when I'm out hunting as I don't like things are getting in the way but that comes off fairly easy, that can go back in the case. You can adjust the width of the beam and concentrate the beam down a little bit by twisting the torch here, that follows the kind of pattern of most uh, torches of this nature, changing the battery is easily done by removing the rear cap, replacing your 18650 battery. Uh, only takes one at a time, so it's quite good that they're giving you a spare one. One thing I do like about this torch is changing the infrared, or changing sorry, the pill from red to white to infrared, because it's pretty easy um, on this torch. So I'll uh, quickly show you how that's done. So we've got our red pill in, and say we want to change it for our green pill. How do we do that? First thing we do is unscrew the head. Place that to one side. Second thing you need to do is just screw down the, uh, the zoom ring which will expose the brass pill housing and then you simply unscrew that. Take your green pill, simply screw that one in. One of the downsides, personally for me, is the bracket that it comes with. So the metal one uh, and the plastic one, although they're okay, there's no adjustment there. So personally, uh, this is just a tip from me, um, for around 14 quid, you can actually buy an adjustable bracket on eBay. This allows you to adjust the windage and elevation, and I'll insert a little clip here as to um, why that's um, a good idea. Essentially, that when you're lamping, so if you're using this on your rifle mounted on your scope, as you see in the image here, and you want to be able to get the, the red circle as it was to match up with your scope. And so as you look through the scope, and again I'll try my best to kind of video what I mean by this, um, as you look through your scope you need to be able to concentrate the beam. You don't want to be lighting up the entire area, you want to concentrate um, your beam on effectively just what, what your scope can see, perhaps a little bit more so you're able to perhaps look up and see, and see what's around. So there's a top tip, get hold of one of those and they fit a weaver style rail stock. So for me the torch, um, it's a good thumbs up, it's a real versatile piece of kit. Um, and I don't see why anyone looking to get into uh, nighttime shooting wouldn't consider one of these um, in their arsenal. So for the price, yeah, it's a pretty good bit of kit. 
This multi-purpose flashlight has many different options to meet a diverse range of needs. The different light functions which you easily achieve with the click of a button. No harsh pushing or pulling needed, it's a simple as the click of a button. It is windproof, rainproof. This is a must-have for all campers, hunters etc. for the handy person in your life.